clients frequently ask about the optimal sales structure and how they can regularly evaluate it to ensure their ongoing agility. I'm Leena Jaichandran, a sales transformation advisor, founder of Transtipai, a sales performance improvement organization. Today we'll talk about the nine key areas to consider while building a sales structure in the context of dynamic buyer expectations. So number one, buyer persona and journey. Understand your buyer's persona and how their journey has evolved and what are the touch points along the way. Tailor your sales structure to align with the stages of the buyer's journey. Number two, multi-channel approach. Recognize that buyers engage through various channels. Implement a multi-channel sales approach to meet them where they are, whether it's through online platforms or social media or traditional channels. Number three, personalization. Make sure that they see what they want to experience. Buyers expect personalized interactions. Design your sales structure to allow for personalized communication and solutions tailored to individuals. Adaptive selling techniques, extremely crucial. Equip your sales teams with adaptive selling techniques. They should be able to adjust their approach based on individual buyer preferences and the unique characteristics of each interaction. Agility. Number five, agile sales team. Agility is the key within your sales teams. Enable them to quickly adapt to changes in buyer's behaviors, market, trends, and competitive landscape. Number six, educated sales team. This is non-negotiable. Ensure your sales team are continuously educated about the industry products and the changing needs of the buyers. Continuous training with industry experts are crucial. Number seven, cross-functional collaboration, a holistic approach. Collaboration between sales, marketing, and customer service is important because all of them are touch points for your customers. This is a holistic approach that integrates these functions and can greatly enhance the overall buyer experience. Number eight, data-driven decision-making. This cannot be ignored in today's world of AI. Leverage data analytics to understand buyers' behavior and preferences. Use this data to make informed decisions about your sales strategy, content, and engagement tactics. Number nine, evolving value proposition. Regularly evaluate and adapt your value proposition on buyers' needs, changes, and your sales structure should reflect the evolving value you provide to customers. Lastly, and most important, transparency is the key. As always, transparency and ethical practices build trust with today's and always discerning buyers. Do you want to assess and evaluate your current sales structure and receive customized recommendations for improvement? Then let's connect.